31 actions you continue to do wrong. There are some things we're so used to doing that we don't realize we're actually doing them the wrong way. Welcome to Life Beam, and today we'll be taking a look at 31 actions you continue to do wrong. Stay until the end of our video to find out about these things you don't know you're actually doing incorrectly. And also subscribe to our channel for more great videos like today. Without further ado, let's begin with our countdown. Number 31, Refrigerating Cold Food One of the most shocking ways you're doing wrong in the kitchen is waiting for hot food to cool before putting it away. While many people believe this is a safer way to store those leftovers, the opposite is actually true. Food should never spend more than two hours outside of a refrigerator. Number 30, Plunging a Clogged Sink with a Toilet Plunger Your toilet plunger is meant for the toilet, not for the sink. If you've ever wondered why plunging a clogged sink never yields any results, it's likely because you're using the wrong tool. For this task, you should be using a cup plunger, a wider plunger with an evenly distributed bottom that can properly affix to the bottom of your sink. Number 29. Washing your hands for less than 20 seconds. You're probably washing your hands with relative frequency throughout the day. In fact, according to the National Cleaning Institute, 50% of adults wash their hands more than 10 times every single day. If you want to rid your hands of potentially harmful germs, wet your hands first, lather with soap, spend at least 20 seconds washing them together, rinse with clean water, and turn off the tap with your elbow to be extra safe. Number 28. Brushing your teeth after eating. Many people brush their teeth twice a day, once when they wake up and once before they go to sleep. But if you're one of those who's brushing post meals as well, you're not actually doing your oral health a favor. You need to brush your teeth right at the beginning of your day and right at the end if you want to be healthy. Number 27, using too much mouthwash. While using mouthwash every now and then can help keep your mouth healthy, using it too frequently can have the opposite effect. Studies have revealed that frequent mouthwash use may actually increase a person's risk for developing type 2 diabetes. Number 26. Taking too many showers. Showers admittedly feel fantastic, but spending a prolonged period of time under that warm tap may actually have a deleterious effect on your body. Not only can showering too frequently wash off some of the good bacteria on your body that keeps you healthy, but it can also lead to skin problems such as eczema. Number 25. Grabbing a glass of wine by the bowl. If you're holding your wine glass by the bowl, you're making a common mistake. The heat from your hand can alter the flavor of your beverage. Instead, hold the glass by the stem, which may feel dangerous, but it's actually quite helpful. Number 24. Storing your glasses upside down. Storing your wine glasses upside down is yet another common mistake that you should work to avoid. While placing wine glasses on the shelf brim down may keep the dust from getting into them, it could also make them more prone to breakage. Standing them stem down, and not only you'll increase their longevity, but reduce the risk of getting moisture trapped inside the cup. Number 23. Trimming your nails. You might have noticed that your nail clippers have become a subtle curve, as if they're designed for a single snip action. That may have been the intent, but it actually takes three or four clips across the length of the average toenail to tidy up those hands. Whatever you do, just don't cram your nail clipper head and start snipping. Number 22. Loading your dishwasher. If you think all parts of your dishwasher are created equal, think again. Specific areas are more adept at cleaning specific grime. Dishes soiled with carbohydrate-heavy foods will get cleaner placed closer to the center of the machine while those with remnants of protein-rich foods are better off on the perimeter of the bottom rack. Number 21. Putting eggs at the door of your fridge. The door of your fridge may have an obvious spot for those cartons of milk and eggs, but storing them there can actually do more harm than good. Foods prone to spoiling quickly should be placed at the bottom shelf towards the back, where it's cooler. Number 20. Pouring detergent on your clothes. It always seems important to keep our clothes as clean as possible, but pouring detergent on them can actually be harmful if you pour it directly into the fabric. Instead, fill up the drum with water and pour your detergent in so it will be evenly distributed on all your clothes. Number 19. 
cleansing your blender in the dishwasher. If you're just rinsing out your blender when you're done with it and popping it in the dishwasher, odds are it isn't getting as clean as it could. Instead, fill your blender with a little bit of warm water and dish soap and run it for a few seconds to get the inside sparkling before rinsing it out. Number 18. Overwashing your jeans. Jeans aren't meant to be cleaned after every use, as there's no better way to ruin the shape and color of your favorite denim than washing them after every wear. It will make them lose their fabric, but if you want to clean them, try freezing them instead to kill the remaining bacteria. It does work and will not hurt the fabrics. Number 17. Brushing your hair from the bottom. While you may find it has more tangles towards the bottom, if you're not brushing from the top, you're not doing yourself any favors. Brushing from the scalp downward helps distribute some of the oils produced by your scalp, making your hair look shinier and helping you keep your scalp from looking greasy. Number 16. Stretching before exercising. Many people may have told you that stretching before a workout can keep you safe from exercise-related injuries, but according to science, that's not necessarily the case. It's not really necessary, but if you want to do it, then by all means go ahead. Just don't count on it for reducing your chance of injuries. Number 15. Composting things wrong. Getting a composting bin is the first step towards making the planet a healthier place, but you should avoid attempting to compost citrus peels, onions, bread, and walnuts. Number 14. Using a bobby pin the wrong way. If you've ever wondered why your bobby pins never stay put, the answer is simple. You're using them wrong. Instead of putting the wavy side up, make sure that it's facing your head when you secure your hair. Number 13. Using your napkin when food arrives. While it may seem to make sense to put your napkin in your lap when your food arrives, doing so is actually a major faux pas. You should put your napkin in your lap as soon as you're seated. Number 12. Keeping your head warm. You've probably heard that a person's body heat is lost through their head, but if you're trying to keep your whole body warm solely by loading up on cozy hats, you're making a mistake. Actually, only 7% of a person's body heat is lost through their head, far less than the 45-50% to 50 range often reported. Focus on warming your whole body instead of your head. Number 11. Not using enough sunscreen. Sometimes people forget how to apply sunscreen correctly. Only pouring a little bit of it and expecting your skin to be protected is a mistake. You should use a shot glass sized amount to cover your whole body. And timing matters too. For maximum effect, it's important to apply your sunscreen protection at least 15 minutes before stepping outside. Number 10. Not using aluminum foil tabs. If you find that aluminum foil always shreds up before correctly pulling a tab of sheets out of the box, chances are you're doing things wrong. You should better push the tabs in on either end of the packaging and you'll secure the roll, making those shredding sheets a thing of the past. Number 9. Softening ice cream in the microwave. Seriously, stop softening ice cream in the microwave if you want to eat it now. Instead, pop it into a sealed, freezer-safe plastic bag and it won't harden as much while you're keeping it cold. Number 8. Use your oven's warming drawer. Keeping your dishes warm by covering them with aluminum foil or heating them up again in the microwave is hardly the most effective means of maintaining their temperature. Instead, use the warming drawer below the door to your stove. Number 7. Takeout containers. Oh, Chinese food. So delicious and comforting. What's better than a quiet night watching Netflix and eating Chinese food straight from the box? Those cardboard takeout boxes are very iconic. But instead of scraping the bottom for the last of your noodles, you can unfold the containers and use them as a plate. You wouldn't need to use additional dishes, which would save you time while washing dishes. Number 6. Saucepan Handles The fun part about cooking is that it inevitably leads to eating. But the not really fun part is the cleaning that comes afterwards. If you've ever made a mess by dipping a spoon in a saucepan with food and then leaving the spoon over the countertop, this handy trick will save your life. Almost every saucepan has a hole in the handle, so you can use it to balance the spoon and minimize the cleanup after. Number 5. Cooling drinks incorrectly. If you need to make drinks cold quickly, there's an easy way. Fill a large bowl or bucket with water and ice in equal measures. 
Then add two tablespoons of salt per one liter of water in your container. Submerge your bottles in the water so they are completely covered, and in two minutes, your drink should be eight to 10 degrees cooler. Number four, pasta ladles. Has it ever happened to you that when you cook pasta, you realize you've made too much? Pasta gets bigger when you cook it, and you can end up with more than what you needed. It can be really confusing to pick the perfect serving size, but this would not be a problem anymore. The little hole in a pasta ladle can save the day, or the meal to be specific. You can use it to measure out how much pasta you have to cook, and it gives you just the right amount for a meal for one. Isn't that amazing? Number three, dental floss. Whenever you go to the dentist, they always will remind you to floss. Yeah, it's really important, but honestly, it sure can be a pain. Here's the hack. Tie your floss in a knot. It will increase the tension of the floss and make it easier to use. Also, if you want to use it this way, it would be less likely that you'll lose your grip. Thanks to this trick, your dentist will be so proud of you. Number two, cutting oranges wrong. Oranges are delicious. They are good for you and fun to eat as well. But all the fun and happiness fades away when you're done. There's juice everywhere and everything gets sticky, but you won't have to worry anymore. There's a better way to do it and make the whole experience easier too. Cut the orange on both ends, top and bottom, and just pull it open. The orange will unwrap very easily and the skin can be used to keep it all together. Very handy, right? Number one, cotton swabs on your ears. Cotton swabs can damage your hearing. In fact, there's really no reason to be cleaning out earwax from your inner ears in the first place. So what's your opinion on these 31 actions you continue to do wrong? Let us know in the comments. Also make sure to leave us a like, share this video with your friends, and also subscribe to our channel and turn notifications on for more great videos like this one. We hope you enjoyed our video and we'll see you next time.